Yeah, what's going on? It, 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 it's really quite simple. And that is that uh, there's a funny little line that says it's impossible to be lonely if you love the one you're alone with. And most people that I know, including myself, entered, used to enter into relationship in order to overcome that sense of loneliness without recognizing that the loneliness is caused by the fact that I hate myself. I hate the self I'm alone with. And as long as I hate the one I'm alone with, no one and nothing can fix that. There, there's, no, there's no outside solution to that so-called loneliness, which is just another word for self-hatred. And most relationships that, that I work with and have encountered, including my own, have been a, a desperate search to find an answer outside of me. If only Susan were in love with me, then I wouldn't feel so lonely. And of course, when we get together, Susan, you're madly in love with me and it feels fantastic. We both are complete. The relationship is full. It's, uh, we enjoy each other's company. And then guess what? It doesn't take long and the self-hatred comes to the surface again. And then that starts being projected on my partner. And then it's my partner who's the cause for my loneliness in almost every case. Now, if I'm a little more spiritually inclined, I'm quite willing to say it is I who causes that loneliness, but I don't know how to fix it. And that loneliness will be um, all pervasive. And it doesn't matter who I'm with or what I'm doing or uh, whether I join yet another group that I feel akin to, whether I join a political party because they have similar points of view as I do, uh, whether I travel to a country where people all have the same skin color so I don't have to feel like an outsider, whatever it is, none of it's going to work. Because it all comes from a desperate, desperate need to finally say, this is not about anyone else. Step two, step two, step two, you may remember. Uh, and that means that loneliness has nothing to do with my partner or the relationship. And it comes from me. He... So whatever happens in your relationships, be gentle with yourself. And ideally, of course, be gentle with the other, whoever the other is as well. But the primary gentleness is required for me. Because if I don't do that, if I don't treat myself with some kindness, some level of kindness, some level of acceptance, I will project that self-hatred. And it will be a mess. It will guaranteed be a mess.